The Museum of Contemporary Art Cleveland is itself a work of art, infused with geometry rising 60 feet from a hexagonal base to a square top on a triangle-shaped location. Its mirrored finish reflects its surroundings, creating at times an optical illusion. Prior to this project, the arts organization had never before owned its own building. So not only does this stunning new home mean the potential for an increased budget and more visitors, Executive Director Jill Snyder said it's also opened up other opportunities, such as facility rental possibilities and a partnership with Marigold Catering. I am so in love with this building and it is so responsive to so many of the qualities that, and, be, and more. I mean, it, it achieved our goals, our stated goals in, uh, from the design standpoint, but it also has delivered on surprises. Um, the drama of the monumental stair is extraordinary. Um, as you walk up the stair and then look back down, it's like people uh, making their way up a hillside. And that is in the sense of, of excitement that comes from that, the physical excitement, but also the social interaction. But also coming into the gallery space and seeing this as a warm, inviting space where people want to linger and look at the art and uh, talk with one another, that seems very successful to me too. This is the last best location at University Circle and it's an extraordinary location because of the intersection, not only physically of Euclid and Ford and Mayfield, but at the intersection of the university community, the cultural community, Little Italy and other surrounding neighborhoods, the art school. We are really at the nexus of these communities. Our mission is based on the uh, bridging the art and ideas of our time, and so it uh, it uh, it pointed to University Circle being the the appropriate place for us to be. And once we were focused on University Circle, then of course it was waiting for the right opportunity to present itself. We our former location was a, a, a marginal location, and there were some uh, opportunities here at University Circle, but they they too felt marginal. So it was finding a location that felt uh, central.